hello guys in this video i'm going to teach you how to implement low battery voltage alarm and funnel controller uh, this is the battery installed in the funnel cnc controller uh, first of all we need to know what is that battery why we are using that in cnc system then we can easily understand what we are going to uh, do in the future slides okay so first of all if we take any funnel controller we have a lithium battery installed at the back of the controller maybe if it is a lcd type you can find it on easily on back side if it is rack mounted then you can find it on the control panel so using that battery we are going to save the sram memory data so for example sram memory data is is contains the system parameters okay you just think when the device power like cnc machine power is disconnected during that time this battery will save the data and prevent it from being lost so this is the purpose of the battery that we are using in cnc machine when the device when the cnc machine used used for a long time the lithium battery voltage drops everything will know this if you use the battery for a long 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 time the voltage will get dropped for example we are using a tv remote in our home so uh, after one or two years remote won't work properly and later we will find the battery is problematic then we will replace the battery we will buy new and re replace the battery then remote will work fine as like uh, from day one the same happening here suppose when the device is used for a long time the lithium battery voltage drops if the system power is turned off at this time the battery voltage is not enough to provide power supply for the sram memory so in this time our data will be lost and the system alarm will occur so this is the purpose of the lithium battery in cnc machine and what will happen uh, if voltage is getting dropped in cnc machine to prevent this what we have to do we need to uh, uh, make a pmc logic by default fonox cnc will give you the bat warning message on the lcd screen as a flash prompt but uh, if you take any cnc machines the first contact will be the operators operators is going uh, to do the settings and whatever they will do and they will try to achieve their day target output target so if 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 they are seeing this bat message and they won't recognize this as a serious issue and they will easily overcome this however operators often ignore this warning message so this is the problem uh, because uh, technicians won't notice this then some day some day we will we will encounter problem with the like uh, parameter loss then we will discover okay battery is the problem battery is gone we need to replace the battery so what we have to do uh, to prevent this for this we need to we need to do a pmc logic see this is the example screen example screen of a uh, bat warning message on lcd screen the screen will be like this so op operators can able uh, can able to do ec bypass so they won't recognize this they won't inform to any technician or maintenance person so uh, when we will realize when the parameter all all system parameter will get lost that time only we will realize so to prevent this we need to trigger alarm in pmc in funux cnc whenever the battery voltage is getting dropped this f1.6 signal is triggered from cnc to pmc so by using this signal we need to make a logic to give the information to technicians or maintenance persons by doing this we can easily realize the battery prompt okay so this is the logic whenever f1.2 is getting turned on a9.4 should be turned on so what will happen if this turn on feed old hack to message will come the machine cannot run it will give us a alarm see this is the alarm information cnc memory battery low change battery in cnc 
power supply do not turn off the CNC why they are saying do not turn off the CNC this is the example screen after triggering a 9.4 through 1.2 okay so then uh, it is recommended that the battery should be replaced regularly every year regardless of whether the controller battery power is sufficient when replacing the battery please replace the battery with the power on if the battery is replaced with the power off please back up the device parameters before replacement to prevent system parameter loss because if uh, if the machine is in running mode there is no need to supply the power like from the battery because machine is running we have the memory is on keep on 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 machine running when the power is getting off that time we need to give the power to the SRAM memory so that's what a lithium battery is doing okay so uh, please keep in your mind whenever you're changing the battery you should do it online with the machine power on condition don't do in off condition if you are going to do in off condition then you might able to have you might have the backup parameters otherwise you cannot bring your machine back into your normal mode because this can lead this will lead into system parameter loss so please be cautious when doing this uh, okay guys thanks for watching this is enough today and i will meet with you a new concept in the next video uh, if you like this video if you thought if you have learned a lot of things from this video please share this video with your friends and see you next time